everyone. It's me, Kate, checking in with you to see if um, you all wrote last week. I'm telling you that I did. I did, as I typically do, two pages a day. And I also did the assignment along with you of writing a letter. And I chose to write my letter to a character in the novel that I'm working on. And that made me think of something that I wanted to tell you because I wrote that letter by hand because I find that I'm a different writer when I write by hand as opposed to typing on the computer. And so it's a question that y'all might want to ask yourselves as you proceed in this writing journey is which way is it easier for me to get in touch with the story? Is it by writing on a computer or is it writing on hand? There's no, there's no right answer. It's just something for y'all to think about. Okay. So, here is my writing task for this week and uh, it should be something that makes you really happy. So I live in a house and I've got a friend who lives in um, uh, the house across the street from mine. She's a writer too. Uh, when we get up and start writing we both turn on lights so that we know that the other one is up and it is incredibly comforting to know that somebody is writing along with you even though they're not with you. So I wonder if you could reach out to somebody and find a writing buddy for the rest of this journey. It doesn't have to be anybody that lives in your neighborhood. It can be somebody that lives in another state or another country. It's just somebody that you're gonna check in with and that you're gonna say, I did my work today. Did you do your work today? And it just helps you stay on the path. So that is your task for this week and that and that you find a place and a time to write every day. Okay, stay well.